Capricorns, beautiful queens, handsome kings, welcome to Unique and Unapologetic Tarot. How you doing, beautiful queens and handsome kings? Cross watches, you're welcome. Capricorn could be in your chart or Capricorn is in your life. Cross watcher, Capricorn, take what belongs to you, what don't. Don't put your foot in the shoe that don't fit, okay? Yeah, because it's going to be flushed down the toilet. <laughs> Take this out, beautiful queens and handsome kings. Capricorn, these are supposed to be more based on what's going on in a Capricorn. If you're negative, you, what you need to change. If you're positive, congratulations, Capricorn, for pushing these people out your life. You, you. All right, thank everybody for likes, donations, comments, book and readings. If you need my information, hit the arrow under the title or my emails in the back. Beautiful Queens and Handsome Kings again. Okay. If you take it offensive, you're the negative person that needs to do that shadow work. Do shadow work, Beautiful Queens and Handsome Kings. Okay. Don't take it personal. I don't take negative comments personal either. I erase it. You got a right to your opinion. As long as you remember it's your opinion. My reasons, but you don't be mad at me, you be mad at spirit for saying so. Good luck. That's not a, that's why I don't fight negative comments. Yeah, look, how teachable are you, my beautiful queens and handsome kings? How teachable are you? Are you teachable enough to do your shadow work, my beautiful queens and handsome kings? Yeah, look, because it says letting go of. Of all the ones that hurt me because they didn't deserve me. Imagine me just came on. Look. So you're setting goals to heal instead. You look, for people that try to control you because you remember. <laughs> you look how? Over what your mama said, over what your daddy did. You want to live before Queens and Handsome Kings. Look. Doing your shadow work, stepping in your life purpose, lover, family, friends, business, stranger, anyone that's done you wrong, they, they, they was doing look violins, they were slowly. Stabbing you in the back. So they slowly gonna face that music. <laughs> Not letting people break you down. They won't get this jaw around my before queens and handsome kings. Yeah, you had some bitter bitches and bitter bums that was victimizing you. And you was really the victim. Or Capricorn, if you the negative one, <laughs> you was <laughs> you had victim conscious. <laughs> or beautiful queens and handsome kings, the positive, you had bitter bitches and bitter bums that had victim conscious. They was victimizing you. And you, it, it, you was the big, look, look at that crow, raven. They were even sending familiar, monitoring, hovering spirits. There's somebody in the covenant group and part of this, look. You admit it, it was hard to see. Damn, they always say, look, look, look. Oh, my God, I ain't never seen this. Yeah, this was a dark-ass person. I ain't never really looked at this car like this, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. This is somebody that was part of that um, wolf covenant. A lot of snakes. I ain't never noticed the wolf part of the dress. I've always seen the snake up there that getting the head cut off. You see that snake? You see the wolf? You see the wolf? You see the demon? So, baby. <laughs> somebody would have, yeah. Sadness. Yeah. But you are mad. <laughs> You unmask or unmasking them bitter bitches and bitter bums, beautiful queens and handsome kings. <laughs> or if you the negative one, she rather than letting uh, somebody divinely unmask show it. <laughs> it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Oh, gone. Every sin is gone. Every mistake, my beautiful queens. Every failure, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. It's all gone. Depression is gone, beautiful queens and handsome kings. By faith. It's gone, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. No self-esteem, it's gone. How teachable are you? 
You're not letting people, oh, they, what they feel about their self on you. All your scars, all your pain is gone, beautiful queen. It's in the past. It was yesterday. Who could change yesterday? Hmm. What your mother did. What your father did. What your family did. <laughs> Look. You are good enough, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. You are good enough. You are good enough. <laughs> it's a time to take action. It's a time to take action. <laughs> How teachable are you? It was time for you to take action. Do your shadow work. Step in your life purpose, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. Getting promotions at jobs. Starting businesses. <laughs> Expanding businesses. Not caring about somebody taking a karmic lover from you. What for? What for? You got a new start coming. You got a new start coming spiritually, physically, and love. If you're single, shit. Lessons for blessing. How teachable are you? You was teachable enough, my beautiful queens and handsome kings that's on the positive side, to know that. Um, <laughs> heal from what you know. You ain't got to worry about trying to prove what you know. Because you this was a lot. Snakes, wolves, snakes, demons. Familiar, hover, admiring spirits to see if they shit was working. Because look, you see that third eye? <laughs> look. Balance. Spirituality. And practicality. Some of y'all had to learn that balance. <laughs> Spirituality and practicality. Look, and no, <laughs> how teachable are you? <laughs> teachable than a motherfucker. It says, you're very close to achieving your goals, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. You've either already healed or started your healing. You already stepped in your life purpose or start stepping in your life purpose. But guess what? <laughs> you know it was time to take action. Somebody was doing altar work on you, too. Firework. Here I am. God. Arms wide open. Uh, Tasha Combs. Gracefully broken. This is a perfect song for this. Pouring out my life. Gracefully broken. Gracefully broken, my beautiful queens and hands. Yeah, I <laughs> can't make this shit up. <laughs> Kanye, compassion, compassion. Look, again, remember, I could be talking to a positive Capricorn or a negative Capricorn or a cross watcher. It is, you know you start. You know you start. Only person that's going to be upset about this and put their panties or boxes up in their butt to have shit things need to get their shit together and start healing, okay? It says release judgment about yourself and others, and focus on the love and light that is within everyone. Yeah, look. Somebody try. somebody, you or somebody tried to judge you, my beautiful queens and handsome kings, and you showed them <laughs> that lotus flower out the mud, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. Y'all, you know, depending on if, whether you're spiritual or religious, spiritual, you, you also know lotus flower is what? Horses, four sons. So that's saying, you know what? Horse said, beautiful queens and handsome kings. <laughs> I'm protecting you. The eye of Horace not only protecting you, his sons. North, south, east, and west. Ain't not. You are surrounded by protection. You are surrounded. <laughs> or if, if you're negative, start doing your shadow work, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. <laughs> Because release judgment of yourself and others. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Focus on love and light that is within everyone. Mm hmm. Remember, somebody had a victim conscious. Somebody was trying to victimize the act like they was the victim. And then they had the nurse to be judgmental because a beautiful queen and handsome king stood up and took action and stood up for themselves. Or healed, did they shadow work and realized that a bitter bitch or bitter bum, whether it was lover, lover could be lover, ex-lover, family, friend, business, stranger, 
Thought they could take their kindness for weakness. Yeah, you you do have a lot. Of, hey. And being Capricorns, you know, y'all instant that. Y'all, 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 y'all underworld, you know what I'm saying? Underworld, you know. Scorpios and Capricorns have to learn. <laughs> I say Pisces too. <laughs> and Gemini. Leos. Damn sure. Okay, let me get the fuck out of this. Anyways, check this out. Have to learn. There's good and bad in all signs. All 12 zodiac signs. There's positive and negative in all signs. But Capricorns, Scorpios, y'all have to learn. Just because you came from the underworld. Not to dim nobody's motherfucking light. But to realize that you got a good heart too. And let the light shine up on you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Guardian children. Now, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. Some of y'all might have lost a child or children. My heart truly goes after you. But Dharma, guardian children, know that. I, I you know, unique looks at diff different. You lost the body. You did not lose a soul. Everybody came here for assignment. I wish upon nobody to lose a loved one, whether it's a child or a friend, family, any anyone. But know, my beautiful queens and handsome kings, your children are not your ch just your children. Your children already have signed the contract to be your guardian angels. And what else could protect you through what you've been going through? Lord, this makes me want to cry. Because somebody in here, I love you, beautiful queen. I love you, handsome king. But we not wrong, love the children. Your baby understood the assignment. They didn't leave you. They became your guardian angel. That's, uh, get the fuck. They told me to pick it back up. Lotus flower. Lotus flower, horse children. Baby, I love you, beautiful queens and handsome kings. I love you. No. Stop. There's nothing wrong with grieving and mourning, but start celebrating. Start knowing you just, hey. Imagine a guardian angel that is as pure, uh, pure so as a child. Who can, who can fuck with that? Because what God gonna do with that? They do that, baby. Shit. <laughs> Look, compassion. Somebody tried to take kindness for weakness. Or my beautiful queens and handsome kings, y'all try to take somebody kind. And you you find that now they they have control and balance. So look, how teachable are you? Positive, how teachable are you? You had to learn. <laughs> somebody, yes, yeah, somebody was victimizing you and acting like the victim. But instead of you trying to prove what you know, you heal from what you know. My beautiful queens and handsome kings, if you the negative one, <laughs> that meant <laughs> how teachable are you? <laughs> They say when you point a finger, three point back. So why whoever negative was judging, they was really reflecting what they see, the negativity that they seen in they self. And they and the victim, the they got victim conscious is instead of healing from whatever victimized them. Whether it was abandonment or trauma issues, they don't realize they're really doing devilish ass activities, victimizing and, and making excuses for it, and then try to judge. How are you gonna judge somebody? <laughs> and you a coward, throwing stones and hiding your hand. Look how teach how teach you are you? <laughs> when they learn, somebody thought my beautiful queens and handsome kings, whoever on the positive side, that. They was going to be able to keep on poking the bear. <laughs> and you would fight them back, but they finding out. Here I am, God. <laughs> you got to get the fuck out of here. Y'all, I don't want to fucking cry. My hands start shaking. I love you, beautiful queens and handsome kings. Hey. Judgment. Judgment. <laughs> Judgment. <laughs> Whoever was negative, 
Leave. <laughs> Try, they didn't want to release judgment about others. <laughs> Ross said, okay. <laughs> Let me show you who the real judge and jury the fuck is. You're not the victim. you actually victimizing my child. All to horse now. Some of y'all saw all the Jesus now. So I'm saying all the horse now. You're holding nothing back. <laughs> you hold nothing back. You put your hands up, beautiful queens and handsome kings, and you praising. You surrendered. You didn't surrender to your enemy. You surrendered to God. I surrendered. <laughs> How teachable are you? You balance your spirituality and practicality. You hear me? Whether it was, whether you're spiritual or religious, you surrendered. And tell, you tell God, have his way. Use you to his will. And that's his way. Surrender, y'all, baby. Off with that motherfucker. Hey, you know the truth. Alpha they had. God said, put your sword down. Yeah, you know the truth about the storms. Put your sword down. If they get too close with you, close to you, I give you permission. That, that it's not illegal <laughs> to protect yourself, spiritually and physically. But put that sword down, because you know the truth, my beautiful queens and handsome kings. And, oh, they thought they was going to take your compassion? Uh, no, no, no. Now we're going to make you, instead of making. See, they were trying to mess with your emotions. Instead of you making emotional, now you make head of a hard decision. <laughs> and you know the truth. You might even listen to them. Hey, 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 hey. You said, I don't have to. If you get too close, I'll put your motherfucking head, because I already know the truth. But... <laughs> I, I, I got some somebody stronger that can whoop your ass. <laughs> truth. And that brought the truth out. Clarity and recovery. Some of these people were from your past, my beautiful queens and handsome again. Some of them was. But guess what? <laughs> you surrender. You was gracefully broken. Um, Tasha Combs, right? <laughs> victory. <laughs> I'm strong when I'm weak because victory and rewards was already wrote in there. You will be free. God's powers is working in you. You was broke gracefully. You were strong when you was weak. How teachable are you before queens and handsome kings? Your enemies will find out you will be free. You will be free whether they want to let you go or not. You're strong before queens and handsome kings. You took that action. Yeah. You was broken gracefully. You weren't broken by your enemy. You want your enemy can break you, my beautiful queens and hands. But but huh, guess what? You broke them. You broke not healing. You broke that generational curse. Here I am, God. Arms wide open. You're not allowing people to trauma bond you or love bond you. Pouring out my heart. Yeah. <laughs> and now they they in despair. They in despair. Because see, then when they was throwing the motherfucking storms, look. <laughs> what did God tell you to do? Put your motherfucking sword down, beautiful queen, handsome king. Yeah, you know the truth. You know the truth. Now if they get too close, I'll put their motherfucking head. But you act. <laughs> Why, why you got to use your store, sword when they were through nine that you trying to keep you in motherfucking anxiety? Now, when you learn, when you learn to heal, got on them knees and gave it to the other. Now, look, now, now they, if they stand up, they're in despair because they know if they try to stand up against you anymore, they lynching, they cutting off their own motherfucking head. Now they in despair. Because they know. All the, hey, they knew when Rod told you to put your motherfucking sword down. <laughs> and why they was acting like the victim and they was victimizing you. <laughs> well, because Rod said, 
They was bold enough to throw them swords at you. Now let them get cut with their own motherfucking swords. I love you, beautiful queens and handsome kings. Yeah. <laughs>